Hey guys, it's Fish and I'm back with a new series. Well, it won't be a series because I'm led to believe that this game is actually very, very short. So around the 20 minute range. So that's perfect for an episode for Fish Gaming. So what is this game? Well, for those of you who've played Limbo, it looks a little bit like Limbo. Um, and it is a puzzle game. Now, it appeared on Steam about a week ago, maybe a little bit longer than that. And it caught my interest because it was free. Not just that. I, I like puzzle games. I like abstract games. I like weird games. You might have noticed that from my uh, desire to play things like Transistor or, um, well, you probably haven't seen any other games that are like that on my channel, but um, I've definitely enjoyed them. So I've played Braid, I've played uh, Limbo, and, and I've, I've really, really enjoyed them. So I, I saw this, it gave me those vibes, and so I thought I would give it a go. Now it is short. Uh, full disclosure, I have played the first puzzle. There are five puzzles apparently, or four puzzles, maybe a fifth, uh, from what I've been led to believe, from what I've been able to read. And I have done the first one. Now the first one, had I recorded it with me bumbling around, would have been cringy. Now I will have a criticism of the developer on that first puzzle, uh, but I think we'd be best to just jump in and have a look at it, noting that this is a very very nice game from what looks like a very very small developer so whether it's a proof of concept or something like that I'm not really sure so let's jump in now here we are now for those of you who have seen Limbo this would give you that massive Limbo vibe because Limbo was all about black shadows and then some some light on the back of it and that's it there was no color there's no shade well it was a bit of shade but it was all black and varying shades of black so here we go the first part of this game is about getting these antennas up and it's very very simple it tells you how to do it x you hold down x and up it lifts now all the puzzles in this are sound based so if you haven't got a sound your sound turned on for whatever reason that might be. I don't know why you would be like that, but uh, to each their own. You're going to struggle to play this game, so I'd highly, highly recommend you find this on Steam. I've linked it to in the description below, uh, so go and check it out. Yeah, there we go. So we've got the three antennas up, and now you get bombarded by these. Ugh, let's just take that to a bit of a, a nicer one. Tone. Yeah, that's a bit easier to deal with. So, I bumbled my way through this, and I noticed that you can press X. And conveniently, I've actually put it on where I need it to be. Let's go somewhere else. Let's go to that. So, you can hear that tone. That's a reference tone that I'm looking for. And I found it over here. Right there. Now, you should see, you can see on the other side that it says a question mark, and that's your way you submit that that... that is the tone that you found. But I was so dumb that I just kept pressing what should be the question mark key without the shift key. Now, I do have a bit of a criticism of the developer on this. Why would you pick question mark? Is your game so full of the other keys that you couldn't have picked K or L or J? Something doesn't require shift because apparently a lot of people in Europe are having big problems with it and really struggling to find which shift modified key actually is uh, this one. So if I were to go off that tone, for instance, and go to that one, and then I press the question mark, it doesn't like it. It's not, nah, you're wrong. So let's go down to the tone. Let's double check that it's our reference tone. And it gets louder, so you can see that it is my tone. So here we go, question mark. This is as far as I've gone. So now, you are stuck with my cringe. So if I can't figure it out, you are stuck. You can see my achievements because I had to put this into video capture mode because for some reason it wouldn't pick it up as a game. But that's okay, because we got it working. All right, let's press shift. Okay, that brings up this next bit. Oh, okay, I gotta hold on to shift and press S at the same time, I guess. There we go. Very nice. Now, does it stop? It does. It does. So let's hold left click and then scroll. 
Okay. I had to hold all of those keys at the same time. <laughs> oh. Cool. Okay. I believe I'm this little robot. Here we are. And if I hold shift, he moves a little bit faster. Now, I don't know what I'm doing on this part, so let's let's investigate together. Okay. In we go. Now, the art style, while simple, uh, is very, very clever. Okay, it wants me to go down, I guess. So, down we go into the abyss, I guess. It's very, very simple, but it's very, very elegant in the way that you do it. And, and I don't think you could pull this off. Not every developer could pull this off, in my opinion. Just because I think there is... Okay, so I'm not getting the signal down here. I guess whatever I need to do needs to be done from the top, so it tricked me. That's okay, game. I don't mind a little bit of backtracking. Let's go up. Let's see if there's something we can find at the top there first that might project the signal down, maybe. And you, for those of you who have probably already played this, or who have already played this, you're going to hate it, because I'm going to make mistakes. A lot of them. Now, where am I going? I don't even know. Oh, we found part of the signal. Okay, I hear something, but I don't know if that's the signal I'm looking for. I'm looking for whatever the second signal is, and I'll bet you it's back where I started. Because I get the distinct impression I've gone too far. There we go. Some more signals. So what has happened in this world? Is this Earth? Who knows? So... There's not a lot of backstory in it. And I guess that's what the point of the puzzle game is, to try and give you some of that that backstory, maybe. Okay, here we go. So, is that how I charge? Okay. Do I run out of battery or something? Let's have a quick look at the thing. Hold when walking. No... I'm not saying that. I'm just going to hold shift the whole time. I wonder if those lights are actually my battery charge. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Let's scroll. Scrolling up to fill this battery, I guess. Interesting. I don't know what that did. Let's go back and see if maybe... Has my battery gone down any? Have my lights gone down? Okay, so I've got to hold shift and that to bring this up. Ah, okay, so I filled the battery of that, which then allowed the, uh, the tower to come up. And I found the third signal. Okay. Cool. So I guess the second signal was me just releasing myself. So the first signal opened it up, and then the second one was me releasing the robot. The third one was this. And so I would say the fourth one, because I don't think there's anything further over here. No. Okay, so that's as far as you can go that way. So let's continue back. And let's see where this takes us. There is a lot of traveling in this game for how simple it is. I don't know, I don't... I, I, I probably could have done without so many antennas, but that's okay. Uh, it's all artistic vision and things like that. Uh, but it does make it a bit harder to try and keep things interesting for you guys. Down we go. Now I'm hoping because of that the signal that we just boosted, maybe we'll get more signal down here. Then again... Maybe I completely misunderstood what I was trying to do with this one. Okay, here we go. No, so I was right. I did need to do that one. There we go. Turned on the lights. 
Cool. Let's keep going. Okay, here we go. So here's a puzzle. Okay, so we have volume sliders. I think I'm trying to match. The tone. Seems to be inverted too, which is kind of annoying. Whoa, that's not even close. on there long enough for me to even get a reference on it. That's close. No. Close on that second one. No. I'm really close. I think the second one's good. So I, I do not want to move that at all. Okay, so the third one up. So close. bit off, isn't it? Okay, so the third one is good. No, I keep stuffing that up. Too deep, too deep. So close. I think we got it. It's not giving me the... Yes! <laughs> so, that... You, <laughs> you have no idea how rewarding it is to complete that. It's so simple yet so rewarding at the same time to complete something so simple. Um... I, I am ear to ear with a smile and I'm, I just, I, I'm feeling really, really good. I'm feeling really good about myself. I know I don't deserve it because that wasn't hard, but we nailed it. All right, here we go. So maybe that's the second signal, I don't know. I'm not really sure. I feel like I've missed something with the second signal, but maybe I didn't. Maybe just releasing myself as a second signal, who knows. Okay, across we go. Let's see if we can find another puzzle to dominate. Hey, you let me through? Yeah, nice. Yeah, yeah. Alright, here we are. Is that me? Yeah, it's me getting freaked out by myself. Whoa, 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 whoa. Let's click. Up you go. Okay. T Y U G H B. Okay, that's not right. So I I have a feeling this is like a hangman thing, but I don't uh, what could be buggy maybe? No, 
can't be buggy. Oops. No, okay. I feel like I've missed something. I feel like there's something I'm supposed to know. This is the cringe I was just talking about, guys. Uh, you, you probably like... For those of you who've played it, you're probably like, That's so easy, fish! Why? And for the rest of you, you're probably just like, Yeah, we, we missed it too, fish. We missed it too. And that's okay. Okay, okay. What have we got? So let's try backwards. B, H, G, U, Y, T. No. Now, is it a hangman? Is it a hangman? Good. What is that? A six and a six. I am really at a loss as to what I'm even supposed to do here, and I don't know that you can even get out of the puzzle once you're in. So I don't. I, I mustn't have missed something. could that make? I'm seeing TH and I'm seeing Y but I don't see how B, G and U would fit into that. Something the bug the gub the thub G I'm overthinking this aren't I? I'm really overthinking it. I cannot, I cannot see any clues on the screen that might lead me to a solution. Bug the, no. Bug the. It's got to be T H Y at the end. Well, it probably doesn't have to be, but. Sub G antenna Wi-Fi. I'm trying to think the general theme. What could I spell from the general theme of this? This 20-minute game has pretty much going to turn into an hour game at this rate because of my own ineptitude. And but I. I could so easily just go and look at the solution, but I don't want to do that because I want to, I want that satisfaction, that satisfaction I had in the last one from such a simple thing. I, I want that again. I want it again. So we've got to try and nut this out in a logical fashion. And I apologise for anyone who is screaming at their screen right now because they can see it. Because I guess my brain just doesn't doesn't think like that and it's got to be a word it's got to be a hangman what if I just put feel like they're the same. I don't think they're arranged in order either. T Y U oh, it's it's I'm so close. I feel so close, and I'll bet you there's people who are telling me, nope, you're not even close, fish. You're stupid. And they're probably right at this stage, because I'm feeling really stupid now. After that massive high, I go to this massive low of, where do I even go? So that doesn't feel right either. Hug. BTY. Bug. And THY. Bug fee is not a word, fish. It's 
stop obsessing over bug theme. What does bug theme even mean? Why am I obsessed with it? What about hub? Hub, no. Hub. Tuffy? No. Oh, so close. But, 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 G, but G, no, there's got to be a word in this, there's got to be a word, I really regret only doing the first one and not doing a full playthrough now, because now I look silly, but I'm not going to abandon this. So, what other words can we get out of this? Uh, youth, Y, no, U, T, H. Yuck, yuck. Yuck, B, no. Yeah, what, what else is there? I feel like I'm just rearranging letters in my head now, hoping that they, they form a word. And maybe they don't even form a word. Maybe they don't even form a word. Is it a word? Yeah, I really feel like G and H are not right next to each other. So... G-T-Y-U-H-B No. T. Just trying to f uh, it's probably It's probably hurting you right now to just keep watching me fail at this. But what I'm doing... It's not... It's not completely silly. What I'm doing is try... Trying to figure out... Uh, if there is a pitch difference, but I don't know if my ears can even hear it. There's nothing in the environment, is there? Above the G. GHT now. Like it's right. Got a Y and a B by 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 H G T by T G H T G H. No. What is left? What is left? I don't even know. I, I... I just... don't... see the solution. I almost feel like I need another vowel. saving you the hassle of listening to me do this for another, who knows, 10 minutes, 20 minutes? Could be a really long time. Alright guys, I'll leave it here and I'll bring you back once I know the solution. I'll see you soon. Alright guys, I'm back and I finally figured it out. Um, so, I was overthinking it massively. Uh, for those of you who haven't done it before, um, should I put a spoiler in this? I suppose I have pretty much spoiled it, the other stuff. 
Um, okay, so you, you want to try and get the tones low to high, and I'm, I'm not really, I'm a little bit tone deaf in time, at times, so I was really struggling with it. Um, and I did get close, uh, but it turns out I stuffed up the order of one or two of them because of that tone deafness, so I just kept plugging away at different things, and, and this, this easily took me half an hour of just trial and error, bang this, bang, bang that. I've got a little notepad here of all the stuff I've tried, and yeah, so we got there in the end. Um, not the sense of accomplishment I had in the last one. Not, uh, and I, I would say it's probably because of the length of time it took me. But that it's neither here nor there. We've now finished this part. Let's move on. Let's just forget that ever happened. All right. In some kind of box now. It's taking me up. What are we doing here? Now, there is a level of pretension to, to games like this, or pretentiousness. I, I don't know, is that the right word? But they, they can be pretentious at times. I mean, even, uh, even um, not Braid, well, Braid was pretentious as hell, but um, even, even uh, Limbo was quite pretentious at times, uh, you know, wanting to show you off just how smart it was. Uh, and, and this game, I'm not getting the vibe that that's what they want, but that's what's coming across. And I did read some forum posts before I came on here, and there are a lot of people who just don't get it or think, oh, what a waste of time. But I mean, for starters, it was free. So you can't really even complain about how much it cost you. Now, yes, time is a factor that you need to put into that, but I mean, if you didn't like the game, you were going to figure that out pretty quickly and pretty early on. So... Uh, I have I have trouble giving sympathy to those kinds of things. But anyway, let's continue on our merry way. Pressing B. Pressing B. Pressing O. Pressing Shift and S. Pressing X. Here we go. All right, another one of these. Okay, so we're looking for that tone. It's not. A, it's not a single on this one. It's a bit different. Okay, so let's continue on. Let's find this tone. Oh, is that it? That's the full signal, so I guess that's the last one. We filled in the little Wi-Fi symbol. So what do we get now? Do we get to figure out what this game was even talking about? Was it Earth? Was it, you know? Uh, uh, I'm a bit of a law nerd. I'm, I'm a guy who likes to know what's going on and why. Okay. Please tell me it's not just, yep, cool. I made a game, and here you go, you're done. It felt... It very much felt like a test of concept. So, you know, then... Maybe it was like a, a, a school project, or like a, a computer science project, or something like that, but it very much felt like a project. Um, it's short, it's sweet, doesn't overstay its welcome. And very, very pretentious at times, and maybe it did overstay its welcome a little bit with that last puzzle, the puzzle before. Whoa! And it's gone. Okay. So that's it. I don't feel a resolution to anything. Do I regret playing it? No. But I don't feel a resolution in this. So, I don't know. I don't know how I feel. I feel very... 
unsure of how I feel. I don't think I wasted my time. It was it was a pretty game. It was a visual spectacle. Well, yeah, I would say it's a visual spectacle. I mean, people can disagree with me all they like on that, but I, I think it was a visual spectacle. Now, you probably don't necessarily need to play it now that I've, I've shown you it, but, I mean, there's, there's no harm in picking it up. I mean, it's free. It doesn't cost you anything to do that. But, yeah, I, I really like my... And I said before, I'm a bit of a law nerd. I like the stories. I mean, a lot of the games I play, I, follow, I, I like to read books written about them and um, just knowing the backstories of this guy or that guy or whatever. And I don't feel like I got any of that. Uh, who was the robot and what was he even doing? Like, he was chasing a signal. Apparently, he had a question about the world. I don't feel like we resolved that. Um, so, I don't know. But I think we'll leave it there. Because I'm so... I don't know about it. I think we'll leave the episode there. Thank you so much for joining me, guys. That is a one-episode series by the name of Antenna. I highly, highly recommend you pick it up. And, uh, yeah, give it a try. And hopefully these guys will put... Uh, will we'll do something a little bit different. Maybe make a bigger game in the future. I really think that they could... They could make a really, really good platformer or story-based game or something along those lines because that felt like it was half there. So, uh, thanks for joining me, guys. Uh, if you enjoyed this episode, please give it a thumbs up. It really does help the channel. If you're new here, please consider subscribing. I put out quality content every single day as, as evidenced by my videos page. You can go back and you can see that I haven't missed a single day so far. All right, I've been Fish. That was Antenna. And I'll catch you next time.